Welcome to our Faith at Home Pentecost series. And this is a wonderful series that a few colleagues of mine and friends developed and their names will be on the screen and to each and every one of them we say thank you. We've translated the work and uh, we hope that you will enjoy this. So this is a series uh, more specifically with the handouts that we're sending you for families with children and teenagers. But for Durankler Family Church's um, English Pentecost, this will be our series. And with every handout um, and activities for the family to do, we will send a video like this. We will also encourage you to, even if you're just adults in your house, to work through the handout. Uh, there might be some activities you don't want to do, but the discussions um, and the way forward um, is very specifically designed for adults to enjoy as well. Today's um, first session is on Ascension Day, which is a day that we remember where the disciples stood and they saw Jesus go away and they might have felt alone. Um, and he promised them that the Holy Spirit will come and that it will be much better for them. But we're reading today a psalm, Psalm 88. So you can uh, take out your Bible, go through the, uh, the leaflet, uh, the handout that we sent with this, and work through it. There are some ideas uh, that I'd like to mention with this. The psalmist feels alone. He's going through something, we are not quite sure what. But that he's suffering and that he's going through it, feeling alone, is quite clear in the psalm. And then the psalm, he says, I am stretching out to you, God, in a prayer. And uh, that lets us think of when we go out and when we exercise. And before we start exercising, we, we stretch and we get ready for this exercise. And uh, it always feels so stupid to do that, but it helps our bodies and our muscles uh, to actually be able to take some more strain on them in the exercise. It doesn't mean that we will not get hurt when we go and exercise, but if we do stretch and do all of those stretches before we do, it helps our bodies to be able to cope with that. And the same is true that when we go through difficult things in life, we don't only stretch for exercise, but we stretch out to people when we also in need and help and comfort, exactly like the Psalter is talking about when he's stretching out to God. Maybe you experiencing um, something or you're going through something, or maybe you can think of someone that's going through something at this time. And even in these difficult times when it's difficult to say that I know God is here, we can stretch out to God. We can stretch out to God because we know He is not far. We can stretch out to God because we know He is here. And on Ascension Day especially, we are reminded that He is not far away, but that God is already here with us and in us. So when you do feel alone or going through something, may you know that you can stretch out to God and that you don't have to stretch out very far because he is there he's already there with you enjoy the handout enjoy enjoy the the wonder uh, the welcome the wonderment and also the way forward see you Sunday with the next session of this hand Pentecost series